The GAA and the ECC has a mission to create an international platform for culture. This year we have Time Space Existence Exhibition and we have space dedicated to universities and research. We have schools coming from all over the world to Venice. We invited the schools to really spend time in Venice for workshops, for lectures, for events where new ideas will come together. They can not just use the space, but also take advantage of what the city can give to them and what the people in the foundation can help them to develop. It's actually quite important for us to be able to bring the research that we do at the faculty to the Biennale. Sometimes universities can become isolated from the actual dialogue that's going on in the industry. And so coming to Venice was the perfect place for us to be able to show what we're interested in in order to engage in that dialogue. Through uh, the GAA's work here and having this, this venue, we all of a sudden get connections that we wouldn't otherwise have. We really see Venice and the Architecture Biennale as an opportunity to really understand the contemporary stuff that's happening in the, the architecture world. So coming to present in a forum where there's so much exposure to lots of different architects and universities and practitioners, this is a really important forum for us to present our work and our ideas. The ECC have been incredible to work with. The professionalism, the curators here have been outstanding. We brought the students to the Biennale because it's the Olympics for architects. And having the students have the opportunity to participate in that is an unbelievably valuable thing. It's a great exposure for the students. It's really eye-opening to come here, be on the world stage of architecture, and see what the rest of the world is doing and the thinking that's going on. And that's, that's only here in Venice. The reason we wanted to be here in Venice is that this is a huge international showcase for, for architecture and, and advanced thinking about architecture. Well, not only people viewing our work, but for us seeing other people's work, it's a perfect venue because there are just uh, hundreds and hundreds of exhibitions here, of very, very high quality work, and that's what we wanted the students to be exposed to. So we really kind of raised the bar a little bit about their own education. We're in Palazzo Mora, which is a beautiful palazzo in the heart of Venice, where we showcase some of the work that we have done over the last couple of years. For the students and the researchers that have worked on this project, it's a wonderful occasion to introduce them to very important people in the discourse of architecture and urban design. The idea to organize this uh, form of exposition in Palazzi of Venice is a very great idea because that gives the opportunity to give a new form of life of these uh, old buildings. For our students and the researchers that are exhibiting here, it's going to be very important for them to see that they don't have to be shy to tell the world about what they're doing. They should come and also be curious, to be active in, in engaging with what's going on in the rest of the world. And the Venice Biennale is the perfect place to do that for architecture in the built environment. This is a very special opportunity for universities to come to Venice and have the platform to be seen and to develop new projects here. So we really try to make the Venetian experience special and the possibility to have support and assistance from our side to make something new and something unique which they would not be able to create somewhere else.